Hello, my name is Anson with Reese Racing and Restoration. Today I'm going to be doing a tutorial on the proper way to use Heat Shield Products DB Skin Sound Deadener. As you can see, we're doing a 67 Chevelle. We're going to be both doing the inside trunk area and the entire underside. I like this product. It works really well. It's really easy to use. And if you follow these simple steps, you can have a lot of luck with this product like I have. Before applying Heat Shield Products DB Skin Sound Deadener, you need to make sure you have a nicely prepped surface. A primered surface works best, just as long as it's not bare metal, as it is not designed to adhere properly to bare metal. Once it is primed and prepped, you need to make sure that it is blown out, vacuumed out, and degreased, so you have a nice, clean, prepped surface to properly lay down the DB skin. Before we get started applying the DB skin to the underside of the Chevelle, there's a few things I would like to go over with you. A few reminders, a few tips, things that I've learned through using the product uh, that I think will really be helpful uh, when you're using it as well. A few preparation tips when using the Heat Shield Products DB skin is prep. Make sure that the car is masked thoroughly. This product does like to creep through seams. Even though it is sandable, you don't want to get it on painted surfaces or any surface where you don't want it seen. Also, when you first open the product, make sure you stir it thoroughly, slowly, not to aerate the product. You want it to remain thick and dense so when you apply it, it goes on nice and thick and you have a nice even coating. For it to work properly, you must stir it thoroughly. Heat Shield Products recommends three ways of applying the DB skin. You can use a brush, a roller, or a shoots spray gun. In this case, I used a gun we use for truck bed coatings. They seem to work really well. Also, they recommend an 80 to 100 PSI. I found that 90 was a happy medium and was giving me the coverage I was looking for. The second tip is you want to apply the material in layers. Thin layers so that it dries quickly. This will increase your turnaround time and you won't be waiting around for this one thick layer to dry. Also, be very consistent. That is the key for this product to work properly. Thin layers and consistency. Ultimately, when you're done, you want the level and layer that you are applying to be about half to exactly the same thickness of the material that is being applied to. So I've already applied the DB skin to the trunk. I'm now going to undercoat the car using the material using a spray gun. But you can also use a paintbrush and a roller to get into some of those tighter, harder to get to places. Make sure that when you're using this product, you wear gloves and a respirator. Um, you don't want to get this stuff on you or in you. Alright, so as you can see, we've finished applying the DB skin to the underside of the vehicle. We've also done the trunk. We're now going to do the interior of the vehicle. And doing the top and bottom is going to optimize the sound deadening and ultimately provide a much better ride quality and improved uh, experience with the vehicle.
right, so yesterday we finished coating the Chevelle, um, both the underside and the inside. Today, it's nicely cured. We're gonna go ahead and unmask the car and uh, see how it turned out. All right, we've got it all unmasked. We're, uh, we're finished. Came out great. As you can see, nice straight tape lines, really great coverage, really good coloration. It went on as planned. Now, during my tips and suggestions, you'll notice it wasn't really detailed. And the reason why is because Heat Shield Products has done a really great job of making this product extremely user friendly. It's almost impossible to mess up. There's no hardeners, there's no reducers. All you do is pour it in the gun and spray it. It air dries, takes only about 15 minutes in between coats. It's extremely user friendly, goes on really nice. This is Anson from Reefs Racing and Restoration. Have a good day.